The geeks are back. Actually, the geeks aren't back. Only one geek is here. Ian Kitajima is here. Where's Bert? Bert is actually at a broadband IoT conference on the mainland. And oh. we were trying to get him in, yeah. but the broadband wasn't working. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> and we should be talking to those guys. So anyway, yeah, you've yeah. got a host of things to talk about anyway. Yeah, so, so the main thing I want to talk about is for all the geeks out there, but also for all the folks who ever wanted a really inexpensive computer, okay. the Raspberry Pi Foundation. So there's a thing called the Raspberry Pi. Okay. Now, it's not Apple Pi, Blueberry. It's actually what's called a single board computer. Okay, and it's very famous because it was, it's been $35 for this little computer. $35 $5 $5 for, a for, computer. The, for a computer. Okay. So this computer, um, they just came out with the fourth generation of what's called the Raspberry Pi 4. Okay. Okay, so for all the geeks out there, they're really loving it. But for the everyday person, like, you know, maybe it's your, your, your father, you want to get a little bit, a small, inexpensive computer for just your kids. Just to surf kids, the web. Just surf the web, yeah. right? And stuff. This is perfect because, really? because now it comes in a one gig, which is the original, but it comes in a two gig and a four gig version. Uh-huh. It's, everything is faster. It's three times faster than the original Raspberry Pi, three, a 3B plus, okay? But it has everything's faster. It's got faster Wi-Fi, it's got faster Bluetooth, it's got gigabit ethernet. Um, it also, what's surprising, it actually has two micro HDMI ports, which basically means you can plug in two monitors. So how come I've never heard of this before? It, you know, it's primarily for all the geeks out there. So yeah. all the geeks are really going, so like our guy in, the ho in our house, uh, he's an applied artificial intelligence, guy, uh -huh. intelligence person. The one thing, that everyone geeks out on these things. They're probably more techy, but the one thing he really loves about this new thing, this new uh, version 4, is that it actually has uh, what's called USB 3. It's called USB 3, and it's 10 times faster than your regular USB so, port. So why buy a, a computer that's worth thousands of dollars now well, as opposed to that? Yeah, so there's just a little bit of limitation. So okay. this is probably really great if you want to do, like like you said, you want to do web surfing, you want right. to do Google Documents, right. uh, you want to, you know, do it, but it's probably not going to replace your thousand dollar laptop. Okay. okay. It's not going to, but it's great if you want the kids to play with okay. it because if they break it, it's not a big deal. Okay. So one gig version is, $35, two gig version is 45, and the four gig version is $55. So I'm you, all in on the top so, end, man. So, so if you got a keyboard, a mouse, okay. and a monitor, yeah. you're good to go, man. Okay, all right, what's good next? to go. What's next? Thanks, man. All right. Appreciate it. Get it to, it's online, you can get it today. So where do you go, raspberry.com? Just go to, just type in Raspberry Pi 4, and you're gonna be going, and okay. uh, just get it, 55 bucks for a four gig okay. version. Okay, yeah. is Bert coming back for the next one? Bert's, Bert will be back. Uh, I know he has Bite Marks Cafe tonight at 6.30, so okay. please tune in and check it out, and we'll, we'll see you guys online and on the air. All right, thanks a lot. Great, thanks guys. All right, Ian.